Hello, my name is Kirk Kimpton, and I'd like to show you today how to use the gutter pricing area of your responsibid account. And um, the way we're going to look at this is assuming that you've turned both exact and rough pricing on. Of course, within your company uh, profile, you can turn off either or. Um, but if you have them both turned on, it gives the customer the opportunity to choose between them. So let's go ahead and start with exact pricing, and um, it'll make a lot of sense, I think. Essentially, if your customer or your people out in the field who are giving the bids are wanting to measure gutter by the exact linear foot, then what you can do is you can just go in and um, tell Responsibid how much you're going to charge to accomplish a basic, a deluxe, or a premium service, assuming that you have them all three turned on. Um, so, for example, a basic service might be scooping everything out. Uh, a deluxe service might be um, scooping everything out and also maybe caulking the joints. Uh, and also maybe because I can see we're charging for downspout cleaning, maybe it also would include high pressure flush of all the downspouts. Uh, and the premium might include installing gutter guards or in, uh, maybe gutter whitening exterior of the gutter, something like that. And then also including the same high pressure downspouts. So if you were to disable this, basically the customer would not be asked how many downspouts they have. So it would in the exact pricing scenario, just ask them for how many linear feet of gutter they want cleaned. So by putting a price in there, you can define what you're going to do for that price at the linear foot um, based on your package builder, which is uh, found under your settings. But um, once you've defined in your own head what that is, then you can attach a price to that and you can determine whether or not you need the customer to tell you how many downspouts that they have. The next item here is access. So if you want to charge more for a home that has a basement or a walkout or whatever you've customized this to be for your area, then you can do that. Or if you feel that that would require an in-person bid, then you can just uh, turn that portion off. Um, and then this pricing would assume that the house is a one-story. So a lot of people actually do. I'm surprised how many people actually leave that at zero percent. They they charge the same to clean gutters on a one-story as a two-story house. Or if you want to charge for the ladder fee that would go along with it, maybe you can charge a 15% or some sort of a percentage over and above what you would charge uh, on a one-story house. Same thing for three stories. It would take the base price and multiply that by, in this case, it would double it because it would be 100% hundred percent more than a, a one-story house so that's how that works and then we have this other feature that you can enable or disable which would ask the customer if they have gutter guards now if you ask them if they have gutter guards you can charge a percentage extra for removing those gutter guards and putting the putting a percentage extra on that um, for for that extra work so if you turn that feature on it will ask the, the customer if they have them or not Okay, I'm going to click save because it's a good habit to get into whenever you're moving around. Um, in the rough pricing, what it's going to use is whatever house sizes you've turned on for your application. So it might be the graphic house size options as here, or it might be square footage intervals if you're using menu pricing. But in any event, it'll um, allow you to put a total flat fee for cleaning gutters at the service levels that are defined in your package builder. So same exact thing as exact pricing, but instead of going by the linear foot, you're just charging based on the house size. So it's a lot easier for the customers. They're not going to be asked very many things um, because responsible already know what size house they live in, but you can also bid you know, the largest size house in person if you choose. And also you have the same access abilities here. So if we were to try to kind of match I think a lot of people would be kind of in that scenario there. And then, uh, again, if you enable the gutter guard scenario, they'll just be asked if they have gutter guards or not, and it'll charge a percentage over the flat fee um, plus the access fee. Again, if they have gutter guards, you can also do the same thing where if they have gutter guards, it's going to automatically trigger an in-person quote. So we can go ahead and click Save on that, and you have completely set up all of the pricing for both exact and rough type quoting of gutter uh, gutter clean out. So if you have any other questions, of course, you can always go to our discuss this area, which is our Q&A forum and ask any question and expect an answer within 24 business hours.